Hello there beautiful people and welcome back again to on how channel for people that don't know my name is NS I'm working for you so if you have any questions any video request make sure to drop on below in a comment I will be happy to make a video for you and for people that do know welcome back please bear witness for that because I made over 200 videos just for you guys about Shopify customizations they were mostly requested by you guys I mean subscribers and some people not even subscribers but I'm fine with that I still make the video of them so don't hesitate if you have any video requests or any questions just drop me a comment below I will be happy to provide you the information you need or even make a video for you and yeah you don't have to subscribe or maybe now you should consider doing so because if you don't you lose because this is a very different chapter on this channel I usually share small customizations but in this chapter I will be sharing complete sections highly customizable to make a Shopify store very professional without having to pay for those expensive teams or hiring those expensive developers or paying for those monthly subscription applications which is worse but I'll give you a better deal scroll down to the channel check out the videos and section I'm sharing and I'll let you decide and I respect your decision but for now let me show you again another request by a subscriber this time I know it's a subscriber which is how to hide the product price only on some products only and this is very handy for people that are out of stock products or some products that they're not sure about the outsourcing process uh, hiding the price can be very handy it can protect you as well so in this video I will fulfill the request and I will show you how to hide the product price on some specific product only that you will specify actually and yeah you guessed right without using any applications again by using our own custom code and without any more talking let's just jump to it as you can see by the way this is Shopify down team as you can see so I always start with completely new team nothing on it in each video I add small customizations so that by the video 60 or 70 the team will be completely different but because now it's different chapter I think I will reach that level by halfway which is 40 or 30 videos for example check out this section right here which is all in one reviews carousel that would show reviews from multiple sources Google Facebook Amazon and Etsy all in one place and it's filterable if I click on Google it will only show me the reviews from Google and so on for Facebook on Amazon and Etsy and this is by using our own custom code no applications involved or check out this uh, recent sales car uh, notification sorry as you can see which will display the recent sales on your Shopify store and it's highly customizable you can customize the behavior for it and how long should uh, be visible for the user and for who to be visible for actually and this is all by using your own custom code no applications involved and many many more as I said just check out the channel man and you will see that for yourself but let me show you how actually to hide the product price on the specific products that you want on your Shopify store by using your own custom code again so the first thing I'm going to do I'm going to access some product for, from my Shopify store so we can do demonstration on it and by the way all the section I scrolled through them in here they are all made by using custom code on all in my uh, channel so make sure to check it out and uh, let me access this product for example I always do demonstration on this one and check out how many widgets in here all of this by using your own custom code no applications involved check out the channel for the million time again so we will keep this page open and we will uh, do the trick come back and see this pricing removed and I will show you how to specify the product that you want the price to hide on and I will show you how it works and show you other products that still have the pricing so you can believe actually so let me get back to Shopify dashboard if you are in Shopify dashboard click on online store then click on teams then click on the three dots or left of customize and click on edit code because as I said we will add our own custom call the next thing we're going to do we need to find the specific file in here on the left panel instead of looking at the files and folders you might get dizzy use the search bar at the top, top left corner sorry then type in main-product just like you see on the screen right now and you will see this file right here main-product.liquid click on it a bunch of code will show up here no worries the next thing we're going to do here we need to find a specific uh, section on this code again and I can directly scroll through it in here and find it but for you case for you case I think I already see it here is this section right here when it says when price or actually scroll down description box and you will see a link from my website click on it and it will take you to this page right here and scroll a little bit down and you will see this right here with the instruction main dash liquid uh, dash product dot liquid and find this section simply uh, copy this code right here get back in here to the code editor click on the code just like you want to write something then if you are Windows click on Control F I'm on Mac I'm going to click on command F and it will show me this prompt at the bottom of the page then simply paste in the code you copied from my website and click enter like this why it should it should highlight it here it is this is very buggy sometimes I will rather use the other one which is Chrome built-in one here it is as you can see 
if I use the Chrome built-in one, it works. I don't know, sometimes this one doesn't work. Anyway, you get the idea. We need to find this file, this section, sorry, on the file right here. And after you did find it, again, get back to my website, then click on this button right here on the right corner to copy the code that we're gonna add. So simply click on it, copy the code, and get back in here. And actually, just a bonus tip, copy the whole code in here and save it somewhere just a precaution maybe in the future we'll make an update so something like that or you can get back to previous version by using this right here but in my case i'm going to keep it like that because i know all my codes work just fine the next thing you're going to do after you did copy the code from my website select from this section right here from the beginning of when price until the end of when inventory you see what it says here when inventory do not select this one just before it select just before it then delete the whole thing just like this and after you delete it as you can see simply paste in our code so let me paste in the code in here then after that click on the save button we're almost done we didn't finish yet because we need to specify which product we need the product uh, the price to be hidden on so get back to shopify dashboard after that simply uh, head over to the product that you want to hide the price on in my case as i said i want to do demonstration on this one so i'm going to search for this product right here so i'm going to search in here for anchor just like this and it should show me the product here it is and the next thing we're going to do is after you access the product you see this section right here where it says tags simply add the tag no price no dash price just like you see no dash price just like you see then add the tag then make sure it's here here is i see it and click on the save button wait for a couple of seconds it's save it we will get back in here reload the page and see what that will do come on reload the page here it is finally i had to reload the page several times because of the browser cache the browser keeps caching the page for faster reloading that's why it prevents the, the changes from taking effect immediately but now in here as you can see it says contact for pricing information and hold on i know maybe you don't want to dis uh, display this maybe you just want to completely remove the pricing and do not display any contact for information or whatever that's very easy simply get back to our code that we did add let me get back to the code editor then click on the three dots again edit code and it will take us to the uh, the file that we did edit let's just scroll down to our code and here it is this is the code that we did add as you can see and this is the section where it says contact for pricing as you can see so simply select from the beginning of dev dev block from the beginning of dev until the closing of dev as you can see from here so select this one from here to here just like you see on the screen very clear right then delete it then click on the save button then it's save it we will get back in here reload the page the browser cache again no this time it didn't as you can see it does not show the pricing anymore and it does not show contact as for pricing whatever and that's how you hide oh hold on let me click on other products so i can show you that actually it works only on the product that we did set the tag of no dash price and that's how to ha you hide the price on specific product that you want on your shopify store by using your own custom code and if you have any questions make sure to drop them below but for now i think my job is done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one